13. Weather from where you live. Tonight we're tracking the third and final wave of rainfall headed our way. You know, we had the two waves yesterday and last night, and this is the third one. Now, you'll see that most of this is going to stay south and southeast of the area, the, the heaviest rainfall. But there's a little bit here in Missouri, and some of that is what will come in very late tonight and tomorrow morning. And with temperatures dropping into the low 30s, it may mix with a little wet snow or change to a brief period of wet snow. And the best chance of precip would be Lafayette, West Lafayette, to Peru and southeastward. Nonetheless, we'll drop to 35 by 3 a.m., 33 at 7, and back to 41 by 11 a.m. tomorrow. After this, Sunday will improve. Monday will improve even more. Much warmer weather, but it will also turn windy once again. Tonight, 29 Winnemac, 33 though Lafayette, 31 Frankfurt, and about 31 at Fowler, as well as Pine Village. Now, tomorrow, Rise into the 40s, low 40s in the north and the northeast with a 43 at Peru and a 44 Logansport, but 48 Lafayette, 49 Pine Village, about 50 at Covington. Much more sunshine on Sunday, mid 50s to perhaps the mid 60s, like the 64 at Covington, but 62 Fowler, 63 Lafayette, and we'll hold on to about 58 at Burlington and 55 at Logansport. Monday, 64 to 71, 64 Peru to about 70 Lafayette, 70 on Covington, and 65 degrees at Winnemac. On our high res future cast, again, it's overcast tonight, and by very late tonight, tomorrow morning, a few showers start to come in. Now, again, I think the best chance of getting precip tonight pretty much be in that Pine Village, West Lafayette to Peru zone and southeastward. It may start out as a little bit of rain, but may mix with a little snow. It may change over to a brief period of at least some wet snow. And if there would happen to be any accumulation from this, it'd be patchy, generally on the grass and car tops, and be very minor. And then we'll get some partial clearing later on tomorrow. And that sets the stage for the mostly sunny Sunday. This is Sunday morning, 926, and notice through the afternoon, mostly sunny skies. And it will warm up as well. Now, once we get into next week, Showers and some thunderstorms come in Wednesday along a warm front, and this warm front will pretty much separate well, early spring from late spring. South of the warm front, it's going to be in the 70s. It may be 80 down in Tennessee and Kentucky, and we're going to be in the 50s Wednesday with some of that rain coming in. Now, by Thursday, the warm front tries to move northward. If the warm front can move north of our area, we'll be in the 70s and we'll have severe weather. If it stays south of here, we'll generally be in the 50s, maybe 60, and we'll have showers and storms that won't necessarily be severe. So the track of that storm system, very important, and we'll keep a close eye on it. 60 Tuesday, there's the 56 Wednesday, 58 Thursday, and then it cools off again to 49 on Friday. The normal high temperature is 57, so a lot of those numbers are closer to normal for a change. We're very slowly getting there. I was just thinking that, we, you know, some seasons we just bump right up and yeah. it's like one day it's winter and the next day it's spring, but that's not happening this year. It's like it? a New England spring. It's just kind of raw and slow. Okay, Chad, thank you sure. very much. More NCAA action tonight. Yeah, we had a couple pretty good games last night. Four more tonight. Coming up, we'll take a look at the